<clears throat> What's up, world? It's your boy LA coming to you with another real like shit segment, man. Tonight's a back to back night, man. Play another West Coast team. Take on the Golden State Warriors. Now, this one of them games, man, where we cannot overlook the Warriors just because they hurt, okay? We have to go out there and face this team as though they as though if they had all their starters. Cause that's the way they did us. When we when we have certain players out there on the floor, do you think they gave a fuck? Fuck no. Nah. They beat our ass. I remember at one point see they put up hundred and forty some points on our on our squad. And 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 shit, that was our bench. They put up hundred and forty some points points on. Cause I remember uh 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 who was it? DeRozan and uh who was it? DeRozan and Lamarcus didn't play. So shit, they don't show us they ain't show nobody no mercy. You know what I'm saying? And it's sad, man, to see them deplete like this, man. But I'm going to tell y'all something. <clears throat> Going back to some videos I put before, I'm going to keep saying this shit. I told Warriors fans, hey, keep, laugh now. Laugh now. I mean, y'all, y'all had it. But, it didn't work out. It didn't manage. You didn't manage right. So, y'all sacrificed. Y'all pretty much sacrificed the chance to win, like, many rings. Because of y'all differences with each other and shit within y'all organization. I knew that KD was going to leave. And fuck y'all around. <laughs> can't call a man no bitch, man, and think he gonna be cool with that shit, man. You can't do it, man. Yeah, that's 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 grown man shit, man. And when Draymond did that shit, that pushed KD right out the motherfucking door. Like that's very disrespectful, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm writing this motherfucker like what? So, I know y'all are probably looking at this car like, what the fuck this nigga got on? This is my goddamn heating pad. Nigga, I got a fucked up spine and a fucked up shoulder. I'm all fucked up. <laughs> yeah, my motherfucking spine, I got some. Just, to, you know, I'm letting y'all land on my life and shit, goddamn it. But, uh, I got. This uh, disease, man, called degenerative disc disease. And basically what it is, it's basically like when your, your, your spine twists and the motherfucker, it shifts and all this, that type of shit and it squeezes. And your vertebrae is just squeeze and it feels like Man, it's, it's just the worst pain, man. Like, a lot, I know a lot of y'all don't know, man. I try to keep a happy profile about myself. But, man, a lot of y'all don't know, man. Man, your boy in pain every single day. But y'all might not see that, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't show my, my, my peoples that. But I'm in pain every single day, man. You know what I'm saying? And this shit here helps me big time. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to y'all. This this shit is better than medicine. I don't like taking out goddamn prescription pills. Fuck that shit. That shit kills you. You know what I'm saying? But uh, <clears throat> yeah, that's why I got this goddamn heating pad on. Cause it's cold, and boy, when it's cold, my shit really get to hurt, nigga. I'd be like, ah, ugh. but man, that ain't gonna stop me from living life, man. You know, I'm a I'm a 
I guess I, I guess you could say I got a high tolerance for pain, man, and a and a and a large love for life. Because I'm 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 I mean sometimes nigga I don't feel like living. This pain be getting me. But goddamn me, I'ma make it through this shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't shit gonna keep me down, man. Ain't shit gonna keep me down. I'ma do this music for y'all. You know what I'm saying? To produce good music for y'all. Ain't shit gonna keep me down. And I'ma keep doing these motherfucking videos, man. You know what I'm saying? I done started it. Ain't ain't, ain't no time. Ain't, ain't no sense of stopping it now. You know what I'm saying? So, I'ma be probably doing this shit, man, until the day I die. To, hey, talking about my Spurs and my Dolphins, man, and other and just sports. I just love sports, man. You know what I'm saying? Now, all sports, I don't really care for that much. But I love sports, though. You know what I'm saying? The overall sports, you know. But uh, back to the lecture at hand. Spurs, we lost a, we lost a tough game last night. Uh I know, I know, man, that a lot of our players is young, y'all. Uh, one thing I don't want to do is rush them. You know what I'm saying? When you rush them, you fuck up. Uh, Lonnie Walker, I'm going to talk to you. DeJounte Murray, I'm going to talk to you. Brian Forbes, rest of the crew, Okay. When Popovich gets in your face and yells at you and tell you that you fucked up and you was horrible in a game, he's telling that shit to you because he means it, because he wants you to get better. If he didn't say shit to you, because he, he really lying he really likes you, man. DeJounte, he really likes you, man. You know what I'm saying? So, whenever, hey, whenever he chewing y'all ass out, man, he want y'all to be better. That's why he does it. He don't mean no harm by it. He want y'all to be better. And I believe that y'all will. So when Pop is chewing you out, just take it, man. Because I guarantee you, it's going to light a fire under your ass. So I look to see. I think he might rest DeMar DeRozan. Uh, I think he might rest DeMar DeRozan and uh, uh, LaMarcus Aldridge this game. If I know Pop, he going to take this game to get his his young guys ready. So you might see, y'all might see a little bit of splash, of, uh, you know. I think you're going to see Lonnie Walker a lot in this game here. I really do, y'all. And uh, I think he going to rest the Rosen, get them ready for to come back home and face the Lakers. So, y'all might, we might not see... Uh, LaMarcus Aldridge and uh, DeRozan tonight, y'all. So get them, let them get some rest. Let this young squad go out there. So you might see a lineup tonight, man. I'm just saying, y'all might see a lineup tonight that consists of DeJounte, Lonnie Walker, probably Derek White, and Probably uh might see Yaka and uh Chimizi Metu. If I know Pop, you're gonna see a lot more of the bench tonight and then a, a, a splash of the third string. You might see Keldon Johnson, you might see a little Witherspoon, you might see Lucas Somnus tonight. That's what I would do. And that's what usually Pop does, but he, I don't know, he might go a different route. I, can, I mean, I'm just picking his brain. But if I know him, he probably going to sit DeRozan and Aldridge tonight and let them young guys play because we can win this game, man, without DeMar DeRozan and LaMarcus. Let them rest. 
we can do it. I know we can. So, I think it'll be good for uh, let our young guys get some uh, experience, especially on the road. And like I say, I'm not. I don't want them to take take the Warriors lightly just because they hurt. I want the young guys to get some playing time, but I want them to go out there and show why they belong in this league. Because I know they do. Lonnie. And DeJounte. And Dirk White. Start shooting the ball. The road, same thing. Start shooting the ball. When y'all come off them pick and rolls, and y'all see y'all got about a five foot difference in uh, you and the defender, come off them pick and rolls. Don't look the drive, man. Stop and pop. I'm giving y'all the blueprint, man, to beat teams. Because y'all are not great three point shooters. Okay? So that means y'all got to take the shots that y'all know y'all can hit. Now, Brian, he's a damn good three-point shooter. But sometimes he he gets he shoots timid like, you know what I'm saying? Stop shooting timid, Brian. Don't like don't get on second guess your shot, man. Let that motherfucker rip, man. I understand it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all playing within the system. Y'all got to pass the ball. Yeah, pass the ball. But if you got shots, man, that's open, stop doing this shit, man, and then turning down wide open shots just for to get a better pass. Stop. Y'all got to stop doing that, man. Because a lot of them shots that y'all turning down could possibly be could possibly be shots that could go in. You won't know unless you let it go. So stop pulling all them damn shots, them wide open shots down, man. Just because a man about to come out and check y'all, it, he got distance. Y'all got distance between them. When you pull up, let that motherfucker rip. Stop second guessing y'all shots. DeJounte and Lonnie, Dirk, I mean, uh, uh, all y'all, Dirk, Lonnie, DeJounte, and DeRozan. Y'all need, to, y'all need to start running that pick and pop game, man. The Rosen probably won't play tonight. But like I said, for everybody else, y'all got to run that pick and pop game, man. You know what I'm saying? That's going to be our bread and butter. I'm telling y'all, that's going to be our bread and butter. Run the pick and roll, stop, shoot. If you got the opening, shoot. If a man ain't on you, shoot, man. Because see what that's going to do, that's going to open up the paint. Okay? That's going to open up the paint. Now motherfuckers got to come out and play us for real. That's going to leave Aldridge down low or whoever down low to work one-on-one. You know what I'm saying? You ain't going to be able to double. If y'all shooting, if y'all running that pick and roll and y'all stopping and popping, just take what the defense give y'all, man. I seen y'all try, y'all tried to force so many plays to get to the rack, man, and y'all lost the ball so many times, man. You ain't got to do that. If if you don't got a clear path or one on one man to get to the cup, man, pick and roll, stop and pop, and you can do that shit to death. Do that shit to motherfuckers to death. Pick and roll, stop and pop. Pick right, stop, pop. Pick left, stop, pop. That's what y'all need to do to beat teams, man. Cause we got shooters, we just ain't got. That many great three-point shooters. Damari Curl is a damn good three-point shooter. Brian Forbes, him and Brian Forbes, and probably Bellinelli is about our three best three-point shooters. You know what I'm saying? Everybody else is kind of whoa whoa on shooting threes. So we have to we have to do certain things, man, to get open 
And that's probably, that's by doing that pick and roll, man. And just two, two point motherfuckers to death. You threes is harder to shoot than twos. You save a lot of energy when you're closer to the basket. Stop letting the man get close on you. Stop doing all this shit. When you go up, let it rip, man. And believe in your shot. Sometimes I be thinking y'all don't believe in y'all shot, man. Like it's like it ain't gonna fall or something, man. And y'all get timid. And when a man get in y'all face, y'all pull the shot down, try to cut to the basket, or y'all try to pass it. Like, dude, shoot the fucking ball, man. It's not hard, man. When you got space between you and your man, y'all better look at what Steph Curry be doing. I'm not saying y'all got to be him, but y'all better look at what he be doing. If he know he got space in between, just give that man, you just give him an inch of space. And he going to let that motherfucker rip. Y'all going to have to do the same thing, man. Y'all got a space between you and the defender, let it go. I guarantee you, man, I guarantee you that we'll be a better team if we start picking, rolling, stopping, and shooting. It's called pick and pop game. Use, let pop show you how to pick and pop. He, man, go back and watch how Tony Parker used to do that. If Tony Parker can't get to the basket, he'll pick and roll, stop, pop. Please go back and watch that shit, man. Because I don't want y'all to force, keep forcing shit to go try to get to the rack and then somebody get hurt. Stop forcing shit, man. You know what I'm saying? We don't got to do that. But who are ready for this game tonight, man? Like, 